Hi guys, welcome back to another video on Vion Studio tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to use Vion templates to create animation animation in five minutes. So let's get started. We're going to use this business friendly one. So I'm already getting ready to start. In the other video we had uh, created a character to use. So let's go ahead and um, Let's go ahead and select the scene. So I'm going to go and uh, that's not right. Go back down here. I'm going to go down here and I'm going to choose a template. So let's start with a template. Let's see. Let's just go to a catering template. Right. And let's just pick up a coffee shop template. All right. Cool. So we're going to go ahead and change some of our characters. So let's go back over here. And this is my saved my library of saved uh people so let's uh select dr lola right there yep wrong one let's do that again i need to right click on her and go ahead and replace and then we're going to put dr lola there and we're going to right click on here and we're going to hit replace and let's put uh if i can get up there let's put laurie there and let's go ahead and change george and we'll put her there and let's do one more so we're going to go ahead and replace her with mom All right so him with mom so there we go we got our characters going so what we want to do is we want to go back down here and we want to right click on that so we're going to continue the scene so our next scene is exactly like the first scene and Let's just do that a couple more times. So we're going to continue that scene. And I'm going to right click on this again. We're going to continue that scene. Okay, so let's go back to the second scene. Well, the first scene. But we want to delete this first scene. So I'm going to right click here and delete that. All right, so we're back to the first scene. So we're going to leave the first scene alone. But now what we want to do is we want to go to the second scene. So let's get her to start talking about something well we can flip her around you know she can be talking over here and let's just go ahead and add uh, al over here and we'll stick al right here and we'll make al a little bigger all right so now let's have al flip his action towards her and let's go over here and see we've got Al highlighted. So we're going to go ahead and let's give Al a, uh, let's give Al a, uh, uh, let's see, how about, let's go up here. Let's say eating something, right? So we'll type in eating something. So he's eating a meal. All right. Well, let's, uh. Let's leave that one alone, all right? So now let's go over her and let's say that she's going to be talking to him. And we're going to do a text to speech. And what we want to do is we can go down here and select who she's going to sound like. So let's just use that. There's a whole big selection here. We can go down and we'll just, all right, Kendra. So she's going to say to him, hey, what or why are you eating standing up with a question mark all right so now we're going to generate that and now when it's done generating we're going to go ahead and listen to it and see if it's the right voice we want to use and make sure it sounds right so here we go hey why are you eating standing up okay so that's good so now let's go to the next scene. Okay. So, oh, okay. So we need to go ahead and because we added him in there, we need to delete these other scenes. So I was a little premature on putting them in front of us. So I'm going to right click on the bottom of there and I'm going to continue the scene. And now I'm going to have him say something to her. And he's got to put his food down. So, 
eating. And we'll go over here and bring it down a little. Um, yeah, let's change it to ice cream, make it a little easier. Make it a little easier for him to, uh, for him to talk eating ice cream. Okay, so over in the second one, we're going to go ahead and change something where he's going to say something to her. And we'll do the text to speech again. And we'll just go down and who cares what we're using. I could not find a seat. Okay, so let's go ahead and generate that. And now let's listen to it. I could not find a seed. All right. So, so we got two of them down here. Okay. So, here's uh, down on the bottom. Let me just expand this up here. Down on the bottom, here's how much she said. So, we got to extend this scene a little. All right. And then we're going to put him up here because that's with that scene. All right. So, let's go ahead and watch everything as far as what we've just generated. All right, let's try that again. Okay, everybody's hey, typing. Why are you eating standing up? I could not find a seed. Okay, so that's done right there. So if you notice, what we did is we got her typing. We want to stop her from typing over here. Or let's just switch her back. So I'm going to right-click that. So I'm going to flip her action. And now I'm going to have, I'm going to go over here and I'm going to turn her head. Right, so she's going to uh, hold on. Let's take it. Let's go back here. She's going to uh, yeah, let's try that again. So we're going to go up here and we're going to put her moving to the left, looking to the left. Well, there you go. It's not doing it again here. Come on, let's go back here. So we're going to do that. We're going to look here, have her look to the left. Come on. All right, well, um, well, how rude is this crap? All right, well, anyway, so let's go and make this other scene. We're going to flip her around. So we're going to flip her action. And... Let's try this one more time here. I don't know why it's not working. Okay, so look to the left. Let's her say let's her let her say let's see if we can move her. Let's put her in a face expression, All right? Looking left, you're not going to help me there, are you? So, let's just have her say, you can have, you can have my seat. I am done. Okay, so let's go select the language. Let's go put her in Karen here and generate it. And then. I have my seat. I am done. And there you go. That's pretty much it. Then we're going to go save it. And that's the end of this video real quick. Oh, we're going to add this. We're going to change this over here. And then we're also going to add the length of the scene to make sure everything coincides with everything. So let's go ahead and look at a preview real quick. Hey, why are you eating standing up? I could not find a seat. You can have my seat. I am done. Now see she has a face mask on. So that ain't going to work. 
So let's exit the preview and she said something like that. So let's go ahead and change her, replace her with Jane. Now Jane has that. Let's see what happens. I'm off. I could not find a seat. You can have my seat. I am done. Oh, I didn't switch her over, did I? Hmm. All right. Now let's try that again. I could not find a seat. You can have my seat. I am done. See how she was talking right there? And that's it. That's the way to make a really quick video. And you just go back here and right click, and we can continue that scene. We go ahead and choose another template. So let's go uh, and say it outside. All right, so somebody's outside now. And then we can continue with that, you know? So let's go ahead and have him say something. Like, like, what a beautiful day to sit outside. Don't you think? All right, well, he's not a female, so we're going to go down and select him. Let's go change him to Russell. We're gonna now we're gonna generate that voice. Now we're gonna go. What's a beautiful test. day to sit outside? Don't you think? All right. So there you go. So that's some of the video right there, and that's how to use Beyond templates to create animation in five minutes. It's really set up for Beyond for beginners, and this is Beyond Studio tutorial. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one.